What is going on, everybody? I am back playing even more Pokemon Xenoverse. I had a blast in the last episode, and I have a good feeling that I'm gonna have a blast in this next episode. I am now in the String Forest. A dark wood crawling with bugs. Well, maybe I should switch my team up to account for that. I do feel like if there's gonna be a whole bunch of bugs here, I should probably get Thundaga and Window Boy in the mix. Huh. Let's fight this guy. Oh, he doesn't want to fight. I've never seen bug type Pokemon like those in my whole life. Come to think of it, I remember something similar in Unova. Oh, are you gonna find some Gen 5 bugs around here? I'm down. I'm very down. It's interesting though, like, is it hailing here or is that like string? Is this a whole bunch of, oh, it's frozen. This is hailing. This is like a cold bug forest. I'm very down for this. Like what's going on in here? Oh, look at this battle background. And a punch bug, huh? Okay, punch bug. Oh, there's different battle music here too. That's so cool. All right, I was about to say, if it survives, I'll catch it, but looks like it didn't survive. Sorry, punch bug. Sorry, it looks like I punched you a little too hard. All right, it's a bummer that that treasure chest was frozen solid. Maybe I could like do something about that later. I wish I could use like a fire move for my fire Pokemon to uh, thaw it out. Ooh, your Pokemon may get poisoned going through the swamp. Hey, it's like a it's like a blighted bog. Okay. Oh, but it's there's a poison mar. Oh, that's really cool. Okay, I need to get the heck out of there. I've never seen anything like this before. That is so freaking cool. There's like a poison buildup meter. That is really, really, really cool. Oh, come on, baby. Don't get poisoned. Oh, uh, yeah, baby. <laughs> I love this. This is such a cool game mechanic. I, I've literally never seen anything like this in a fan game, and it's blowing my mind right now. Look how neat that is. Man, that is really freaking neat. Come on. Come on, man. You can make it through the poison. Yeah. Oh, and there's even more down here. <gasps> a Rotom Dex. Cool. So I can get a full heal there. Oh, so even if all my Pokemon become poisoned, it's not really that big of a deal. Oh, that was weird that that tile was impassable. Oh, that almost screwed me over. Oh, what the heck? People are trapped in here. What the hell is this? This is pretty dark. Let me get you out of here. Get out. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Am I being a... Oh, it's the queen. <gasps> is that a Galvantula? Oh, no. And there's like a bunch of little ice Joltics here. That's so cool! I wanna catch it. It must be an X Pokemon. Oh no, that's ominous. That is actually scary as shit. All right, we got ourselves an X battle here. <laughs> that explains why there was a Rotom up there. I should have saved. I am absolutely gonna try to catch you. I love Galvantula so much. Oh, and it has two health bars? Oh, this is gonna be good. All right, this is gonna be good. This is so cool! Oh, I love this. All right, don't freeze me. Oh, that did a lot of damage despite not being very effective. All right, Fire Fang ought to do a ton though. Oh man. Um, If I Fire Fang again, this won't kill him, right? I'm trying to keep him alive. Oh wait, he's gonna kill me here. Damn. Damn. Da -da 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 damn. All right, yes, of course I'm gonna use the next Pokemon. I am not giving up that easily, no siree. Get in there, Sukuro. All right, uh, double kick him. All right, what do we get? What do we get? Oh, that's so much damage. This Galvantula is quite strong. Okay, I'm not even doing that much damage back. Oh, it's just gonna kill me. It's just gonna kill me. This icy wind, man. Okay. Hmm. I wonder if I should just revive um, Wonder or Window Boy. I almost, I keep almost calling him Wonder Boy. All right, let's get Thundaga in there. No. Maybe Chi-Chi? No. Maybe Devour. Yeah, at least this way I have a priority attack. Um, I could get confused also. That could be good. Let's try that. Ah, he went for Slash, you fool. Now I hope that you hit yourself. But don't hit yourself before I get the chance to catch you, because I would very much like to catch you. <laughs> All right, Aqua Jet. All right, hit yourself, hit yourself. Yeah! That's what it was all for, baby. All right, so now I've reduced it down to one health bar. I'm gonna Aqua Jet one more time. 
All right, if you can hit yourself again, that'd be dope. Oh, baby, this is perfect. Okay, now stop hitting yourself and instead get in the Xeno Ball. I have 37 Xeno Balls. Wow, I did not expect to have that many. I thought maybe I would have had like 25. Yes, I caught him. Oh, God, that's fun. That's so fun. What type are you, Bug Ice? Nice. It freezes the air around its nest. Then it traps prey in a thick ice web, slowly leading them to hypothermia. Dude, this this Pokemon's out here like killing people. This is actually out here just like killing people. I should maybe add it to my team. Oh. I win. Ew, a spider. Objective complete. Thank you. Thank you for saving us. We came here to picnic in the woods when suddenly the air started to get colder and colder. And then I blacked out. That Pokemon I glimpsed not much before fainting must have caught us. I wonder how long we'd have been there if you didn't come to rescue us. Um, sounded like you guys would have died because it freezes people to death. That's like it. That was its Pokedex entry. Sorry, but I got to get back to my little brother now. He must have been worried about me. If you're ever in Stilato Town, come and visit me. I should go too. In gratitude, I want to give you these. Oh, Lepa Berries. Those are good. Thank you, I'll take them. Big time. At the kiosk, they turn them into excellent star cider. <gasps> but I can also use them to restore your pee-pee too. Thanks again. Dude, the cider is so good. Oh, and TM07 Hail. This is such a fun little quest here. Continuing on Route 6, you get to the Milky Way City, a kingdom that hosts a gym. Milky Way, okay. And if you're not in a hurry, you could use the fauna of this swamp for your training. It still has a lot to hide. Well, I'm going back home now. Part of me wonders if I should head back to Stilato and see what that guy's uh, reward was. Oh man, if I was to add Galvantula to my team, who would I even replace? Oh, I really like my current team. If I got an Ice Bug, would I replace like Sekiro? I really like Sekiro though. Damn, I got too many good Pokemon. <laughs> it's hard to pick now. Uh oh, wait, here we go. I just want to go here. Yeah, I'll pay my I'll pay the 500. I think this is worth. This is very worth to get a heal right now. Yep. I'm gonna heal my team. Man, that was so fun. Let's save. <laughs> Let's definitely save. God. I can't get over how much like fun events have happened. I love that it's like back to back, just like action packed. There's always something cool around the corner happening, and that that brings a big smile to my face, man. How could I not be excited when there's events like that? That Galviantula was killing people. I just, I can't get over that. That was brutal. Oh, and this battle background seems a little bit different. That's cool. Oh, man. So this is the end of the forest. I could go over there, but I guess I need Surf to be able to reach that den. Okay, Route 6. Well, we made it out of the String Forest. And let's fight this backpacker now. I can't are waiting for someone to show up. And now let's battle. Okay. If you want a fight, I'm definitely down for a fight. I'm fully healed and I'm ready to kick some ass. Buneary, huh? <laughs> oh, oh you, oh you must be joking. <laughs> yeah, of course, I'm gonna fire fang you. And of course, you're gonna get bopped. I think, there we go, so let's say, I think since my attack's been lowered now, Babel will actually do more damage. And yeah boy gets the KO. Uproar? Would I even want that? I don't think I would even want that, right? Oh, maybe I do want that, because it's a sound type move. Hmm. Yeah, I'll take Uproar. Since it's a sound type, I'll take it. If it was normal type, I would have passed. Gachi Gachu? What is a Gachi Gachi Gachu? Um, I guess I'll keep my, I'll keep Window Boy in and see what happens. What the heck are you? That's kind of a cool looking Pokemon, but what are you? Are you electric? Are you... Oh, uh, ice? You'll... You're definitely ice. We'll take... We'll say that. Could it be ice electric? I'd be down for that. I'd be very down for an ice electric. I like that typing. Ooh, detect. Tech is pretty good, but I'll pass on it for Sekiro. I like Sekiro's current move set. It wasn't such a good idea. That's okay, man. You win some, you lose some, and it just so happens that when you fight me, you lose every time. That's just how it's gonna be sometimes. <gasps> An item. God's item. 
Look at this youngster. He's out here trying to block this path, but I could just swoop. All right, let's fight him. I'm ditching school. I want to become a total cool guy, not a stupid nerd. Oh, man. <laughs> Little did you know that if you're the one skipping school, you're the stupid one. All right, let's go, Blitzel. The real cool guys are the ones who go to school and get an education. Let me tell you, that's pretty cool. All right. Let's destroy this Blitzel. Okie dokie. Uh, Drowsy. I will switch to Devour. Is that a dumb switch? That might be a dumb switch. I'm gonna do it. But this might be a dumb one. Because isn't Ghost good against Psychic? I always get confused on that. I guess we'll find out. I'm gonna Phantom Force him. I'm pretty sure this is gonna be super effective. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, okay, cool. <laughs> I was like second guessing myself for a second, like, Whoa, which type works? Let's go. You sure are strong. You're darn right I am. Well, it wasn't me. It was all my Pokemon. They're carrying me to victory. Oh, look at this. What do we have down here? I see a TM in my sights, and you know I gotta go grab it. Go hollow trappage. <laughs> Acrobatics, oh my gosh, wait a second. Wait a gosh darn second. Acrobatics is one of the most like broken moves just like ever. And now I could potentially teach that to some of my Pokemon. Hello? Hello? Acrobatics, hello now. Um, who can learn it? Okay, Thundaga can learn it, and Sukiro can learn it. Okay, we're teaching that to Thundaga, and we might even be teaching it to Sukiro because it's just so good. So acrobatics is 55, but if I'm not holding an item, it doubles, right? So I could remove his held item, and that turns into a 110. And then I also have stab. Yeah, that's um, that's absurdly good. That's insanely good. Item, take. <laughs> uh, and what's Sukiro's move set again? Power Punch, Knock Off, Rock Tomb. I could replace Rock Tomb with Acrobatics now, and since I already have the Rock Tomb TM, I could go back whenever I want. But then again, that replaces the Black Belt, and I think that might actually be more worth to have a Black Belt on so I get, like, powering up for my stab attacks. You know what? I won't teach him Acrobatics. I'm just going to make that a Thundaga exclusive. Oh my gosh. I'm going to destroy everything now. I am going to eviscerate everybody now. Getting through that tricky wood was hard. Let me catch my breath with a battle. All right, Brianna. I like her uh, trainer art. That's pretty good. Oh, it's a little shelter. All right, hipster. Brianna, what do you got? I will have you know that I just learned an insanely overpowered move. <laughs> I am going to one-shot everybody in existence now. Oh my god. False swipe. False swipe's actually pretty good. But I'm not trying to catch things right now. Right now I'm trying to kill things. Um, so sorry, Chi Chi. Let me know when you want to learn Paper Cut, though. Oh, wait. I need to talk to a move tutor. Maybe Paper Cut is a move that Chi Chi might already know in the past. Look, like, I've got acrobatics, man. I've got a stab acrobatics. Like, what are you going to do? And it's a crit. Acrobatics is busted! It's so good! Why is it so good? Oof! Roblox. Just oof! No way, I'm really falling apart now! Big oof. Big oof, my guy. Oh, that was weird. Did you see that? Like, it's like this ground tile d appeared above me? I made it to Milky Way City, though. Look how cool this is. I want to explore that route a little bit more. But I, I'm at Milky Way City. I'm looking after my family's mill tank. I see why it's called Milky Way. What the heck is this? Oh, it's a knight. Cometh on. This is Milky Way City's kingdom. Wait. Oh, look. There's a little, uh, little shock owl. Or spark owl. I didn't realize that there was knights here. Is this like, am I, did I just go back in time? There's like bards playing like music and stuff. This is really cool. I'm in like a little royal kingdom. Wow. The alleys of the city remind me of my youth. Oh, I miss those days. What is going on over here? This is quite a wild place. Golly, he's getting the chef story out of the end. Wait, hmm? 
A good chef must know how to mix speed and technique. Taste this and let me know what you think. Yes, more risotto. Thank you. I bet you it's delicious. A gourmet version of the Octo risotto. A gourmet version. It might just be the same that I'm used to, right? That'd be cool if it was like special Octo risotto or something. What's going on here? The city is so old fashioned that I can't shoot at anything that can receive a lot of likes. Oh no, another influencer. Oh no, a tiling error. A couple tiling errors, in fact. Oh no. <laughs> I was just staring at the rooftops. Oh, is this ye old Pokemon Center? Hey, ye old Moo Moo Milk. Nice. I'll take it. Can I buy some more? That'd be awesome. Oh, I love the updated interior. Oh my god, this is so cool. This is so cool. This looks so good. All right, I'm gonna save. And I'm gonna talk to that Move Tutor guy and see if Paper Cut is something that I could teach Chi Chi. Move Tutor, teach me moves, please. Chi Chi. What do you want to learn? Okay. Chi Chi cannot learn Paper Cut this way. So I guess I must level up Chi Chi a little bit more. Whoa. Little item market up here. Hello. That's so cool. Oh man, she had really good art too. I think I'm pretty good on my items, but I can buy revives now. Oh wait, and is that an ether? I can buy ethers now? Oh, 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 I'm gonna buy a few. Thank you very much. And how am I on great balls? I'm doing good. How am I on revives? I'm gonna buy a bit more. Might as well spend my money on all this stuff while I can. Oh man, that's good. Mommy's giving me these 10 Pokeballs for doing well in school, but she's throwing this weird white ball too. Hey, thank you. I'll take a, I'll take a free Premier Ball. Please and thank you. Have you already challenged the hashtag gym leaders? Stop using the hashtags. Oh, I hate it. Oh, I hate the influencer trainer class. Oh, we have to learn a specific fairy type move. Okay. Wait, Bremand? There's a Pokemon called Bremand? I'm interested to see this Pokemon that can change forms. I might have a vested interest in seeing Fakemon that can change forms. I just might have a vested interest. Steel Wing, that's good. That's actually quite good. I could replace um, Roost on Thundaga with Steel Wing. I'll think about it. I'm gonna keep Roost in for now though. I like Roost. I like it a lot. Hello. I found this thing in my cake. Maybe you want it. Sure. A Mering update? Okay, you found a little uh, USB drive in your cake? That's gross. Did you put a USB drive in your cake? This realm was ruled by the brave king Acacia once. Too bad his daughter Vanilla is not like him. Oh no, is Vanilla not nice? This is so cool. It's like a, a little like pastry kingdom. This is making me think of almost like a Paper Mario game. This is something that they would do in that, where it's like a bunch of cake knights. Only the Excalibold deserving to rest in the King's Rock on its head shall evolve. So I got to put a King's Rock on a Pokemon to evolve it. Estabold. Hmm. Happily gifting her some sort of souvenir. I could atone mine own sin. Oh man, they're going to be speaking in like regal tones the whole time and I am not going to be able to follow it. But as I was leaving, I noticed a destiny knot in the trash. Nice. You know I gotta be getting all those items. You know I'm gonna be trying to pick up all the items I can. You know I'm gonna just jump into the well right now. You know I can't jump into the well, dang it. Okay, um, what's going on over here? I'm gonna try to find the gym. This is a huge city, oh my gosh. The music does seem a little bit quiet in here too. Hello, I just wanted to catch a spark owl, but its entire flock attacked me. Please help me. Hey, I guess I got these quick balls. Should I try to catch them and help her? Oh, look at Spark Owl. I love, look at its little face. Spark Owl is awesome. I really, really like Spark Owl. Okay, is this where the, let's see. Is this the, well, I guess maybe I can find out for myself. Is this the castle where the gym leader is? Wow, this is so big, the Royal Gardens property of Her Majesty Princess Vanilla. Well, this looks to be the gym. I'm gonna explore the gardens a little bit more. Hello. Oh, you can play with some wild Pokemon? Could I encounter wild Pokemon? I can! Let's go. Oh, a Chigami. I have one of those myself. Okay, um, 
Acrobatics is probably gonna one-shot it, right? Acrobatics is just one-shotting everything. Yep. Sticky Barb. And a rough skin. Oh. Okay, well, I'm currently holding a Sticky Barb now, huh? That's actually gonna weaken Acrobatics. I don't want that. I would very much like to not have a held item. <laughs> All right. And then let's pop a quick Orenberry onto Undaga. I wonder what this gym is all about. This will be the third gym. Now, are they ground type? Are they fairy type? They could be fairy. That's kind of the vibe I'm getting from here. If it's like a fairy tale. Let's see what's going on here. Welcome to Milky Way City's gym, young trainer. I was wondering how long you would take. What? You want to know who I am and why? Well, you just need to know I'm cheering for you. Vanilla, the gym leader, loves fairy type Pokemon. I was right, baby. Like monarchs, they're vulnerable to poison and steel. Interesting, like monarchs. I never made that connection. I guess, isn't fairy also weak to um, sound type? Ooh. I have to prove my value in three ordeals. Okay. Well, if it's gonna be fairy types, I will actually try leading with Window Boy and maybe I'll just hit him with Uproar and then maybe everything will work out just fine. Maybe. Fingers crossed, let's go check it out. What's going on in this big old castle? Welcome, foreigner. If thou art hither to tempt fight, thee should knowest this gym is dissimilar from others. I don't know, am I doing like Australian or British? What was that? Three or ordals awaiten thou behind these doors. The trial of fire is the first one. Once, <laughs> hello, mate. Once thou crosseth the threshold, there is no turning back. Art thou ready, trainer? Uh, yep, let me in, baby. Then Gorston may fate be with you. With thou. Oh, interesting. This is kind of like a Colosseum type vibe. Oh, and she's watching the matches from above, and she has like a special Smeargle. That guy is creepy as shit. What the hell, Armand? Oh my god, that's... Wow. But look at that, the princess. I love that Smeargle. <gasps> hey, look at that Dimension guy up there. Get out of there. Don't get distracted by the Jester. There's an evil Daft Punk member afoot. The trial of Fire. Armand, where are those sweets, I asked you? Um, you, you ate them all, princess. Then I want more! Smeargle, cream puffs! Oh no, she's like a spoiled brat. I like that little art though, that was good. Smee. Look at that Smeargle, that is so good. I love regional like Gen 2, especially because like Smeargle is kind of like underrepresented. They look delicious. Oh, so what are you waiting for? Go ahead. Uh, okay, mom. I mean, ma'am. Okay, mom. I guess the music didn't loop there. The regulation for the trial of fire requires the pretender to the badge to take on the beast. Number one, the beast cannot be caught. Number two, you cannot flee from the beast. Wait, so I have to fight an X Pokemon? End of regulation. Let the beast in. Uh-oh. I can't catch it, though? Oh, boy. Oh, it's a Dredagon. Oh, this is gonna be interesting. The Trial of Fire. I was expecting it to be a fire Pokemon. Draw! Ooh, battle. This is so cool. Look at that battle background, too. This is lovely. It's kind of interesting, though, that this is the, um the fairy type gym, but I'm out here facing dragons. Oh well, I can take them on. Oh no, it's not very effective. Oh gosh. I need to switch. Drudagun is not a good matchup for uh, me right now. So being locked into this move for like two to three turns kind of sucks. At least they're not doing too much damage. All right, let me switch. Okay, well I guess I don't get to switch just yet. The fact that it knows Metal Claw actually is very scary for me because I'd want to switch into Chi-Chi, but Metal Claw is super effective against Chi-Chi, so this is not good. Who do I send out to deal with you? Do I just bite the bullet and send out Thundaga? Do I send out Genos? I don't, maybe I send out Sekiro? I know that Drudigan has rough skin. I'm gonna try hitting it with uh, Genos, do some special damage. Come on, Genos, I believe in you, baby. This guy's not gonna do too much damage. Okay, I take it back. He's doing a shit ton of damage. And he's also faster than you. <gasps> but I got the focus band! I forgot about that. I forgot about that entirely. Okay, I did not do very much damage. All right, well, sorry, Genos. Um, let's switch to Devour. 
All right, I'm gonna try Phantom Forcing, and I'm gonna bet that Dredigan goes for Slash again, and it won't affect me. Okay, I was wrong. Okay, I'm just gonna get one-shotted. Shit. Dude, this guy's tough. All right, now for me to bust up my big guns. Just don't Metal Claw me. Just just don't, uh, don't do Metal Claw, please. <gasps> oh, I'm faster. Die, you bastard. Hey, it's a crit. Okay, cool. Wow. That was pretty rough. That was pretty rough. I kind of got, I kind of got bopped there. Agility. Uh, I don't think I'll learn agility. I'll pass on that for now. And Sekiro levels up too. Nice. That was hardcore. Oh, these sweets are great, yummy, and this trainer's not that bad too. Armand, the trial is over. Now what? I can go back to eating my sweets. Can I? There. Well, there's there's two other trials, princess. Ah, I want to relax, Armand. Let me relax. Come on, come on, man. Uh, okay, well, you could rest a while while we get ready for the second trial, ma'am. <laughs> so be it. Uh, the second trial will take place shortly. The first, I'm going to award you for passing the trial of fire. Hey, golden cup. Nice. Could I sell that? <laughs> Can I make some money with that? Oh, it's a key item. Okay, never mind. Uh, see you soon. Oh, can I go and heal now? I guess I can. Oh, man. Let me uh, bust out my lovely hoverboard. Yeah, baby! I need to go heal. The Pokemon Center was here. I'm out here trying to get some free heals. I'm not trying to uh, spend all of my um, revives and super potions when I could just skate on down and skate right back on up. All right. Let's continue those trials, though. I want to face the next trial. I was expecting it to be like an X beast, but I'm interested to see what's going on over next. Time evolves, too. Oh, that's cool. What's going on over here? Move tutor. Yo, that's cool. The gravity tunnel is true paradise to fossil enthusiasts like myself. Well, I guess I got to beat the gym leader first. Let's go this way. Look how cool that is. I can skate so fast. All right. What's the next trial? Okay, the trial of water. I'm gonna say I'm not ready. If it's the trial of water, I'll send him in, right? Thundaga ought to do good for this. But like, what the heck? The last one was the trial of fire and they sent out a dragon, so maybe for the trial of water, they'll throw out like a steel Pokemon. I don't know, man. All right, let's go. Have, have the fates be with me. Oh, this is cool, An entirely different arena. This is so fancy, what the heck? This is awesome. Now is the time for the trial of water. I will explain. Armand. Hey, Jester. Your stupid dance is driving me crazy. Shut the hell up over there. Okay, I'll stop, princess. Like, I'm sorry. Armand. The trial of water requires you to demonstrate your fishing skills retrieving an item on the lake floor. Caution, this lake is infested with Hanchen. When Hanchen take the bait, they rip off your fishing line. Yummy. Armand, I'm fed up with your rules. Let's begin the trial of water. Oh, I can do this. I've practiced this. I'm quite an expert fisher at this point, I would think. So, is this what a Conchen is? Interesting. Um, That must be the evolution of the other Pokemon that I thought was, like, water flying. Oh god, look at me. No, that hit it! What? Come on! Come on! That barely hit it, if at all. Come on. I am I guess I was moving a little too fast. I was schmoving, I guess. Okay. Come on, baby. You better believe that I'm gonna get it this time. I'm not gonna bump into anything. I won't let anything get in my way. See, I think I'm already at the end. I made it. That was easy. I got the golden spoon. Oh, so I have the golden cup and I have the golden spoon. What's next? Do I have to get the golden ice cream? Once again, this mister passed the trial. So, what now, Armand? Well, the pretender will submit the trial of grass, after which you will face him, princess. I recommend you get ready for the battle. Huh, all right, I guess I'll do it. The third and last trial will take place shortly. I'm excited, man. Let's go see what this third trial's all about. The trial of grass, let me in, baby. Let me in! I'm gonna kick its ass. Oh, this must, this must be a maze. Okay. If it's gonna be a hedge maze, let me get a sip of my water and let's hunker down and let's get into it. Ooh, uh. oh, all right, baby, here we go. Uh, trial of grass. What you gotta do is you gotta hug the left wall, all right? Uh, 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 is this the way? Uh, dead end, right? This must be a dead end. 
Oh my goodness. Did I make it? Oh, it's a knight! Oh! This guy's gonna be cool, though. Look at that! Oh, I love the art for the knight. Paladin, Renaud. Oh, he's a paladin. That's so cool. Oh, man. Look at this battle background, too. They made a specific hedge maze battle background. That is so fancy. Why is acrobatics so good? Okay, that was a crit. But still, that was so good. Chigami is really good, also. I wanna. I want my Chigami to learn paper cut. I'm out here trying to crush people. Okay. Um, well, this feels like I'm running back towards the start now, so this couldn't be right. But I got a hyper potion, so I mean, that's kind of cool. That's pretty cool. I'm always down to get some hyper potions. I get some posh. What's up, dude? You battled this. You battled this with honor. Well, at, that's the least I could do, right? Like, if I'm gonna be one-shotting people with acrobatics, might as well be honorable about it. Let me guess, battle? Uh, or is this the correct way? Or am I running back towards the start? I feel like I'm going backwards now. Um, uh, this way. Oh, that's totally a dead end, though. That's totally a knight. I could tell. Part of me wants to battle him, though. <laughs> I mean, it's free experience, right? A paladin is someone who, for the greater good, treadeth the path of sacrifice. All right, well, you're about to sacrifice your Pokemon to the acrobatics gods because uh, I'm coming in here for blood. It's wild that they all have Chigami, though. And here I was thinking I was special for having a Chigami. I, if, if I didn't have a Chigami on me, <laughs> words are hard. If I didn't have a Chigami on my team already, I would see this and think, wow, that's a strong Pokemon. I hate it. I would probably hate it. Ooh, Dream Eater. Um, that's good. That's good, right? Because I have Hypnosis already. Um, I'll get rid of Confuse Ray. If I can Hypnosis Dream Eater people, I'm gonna be busted. Wait, Excalibold? What is this? Whoa! Are you... Are you Fairy Steel or something? Not very effective. I mean, it still did a lot of damage, though. Whoa! Oh, he fell over. Okay. <laughs> um... Acrobatics? What is this guy all about? Oh, gosh. Wait. Okay, that didn't hurt too bad. I could actually probably roost here. Go for a sharpen again, I dare you. Yeah, look at me, I'm right back up to full. Takedown. Okay, that didn't hurt too bad. Hey, static. You know what, I'm gonna roost again and get some free full heals here. And then he's probably gonna be paralyzed. And then, I'll take him out. Oh. Okay, well, he could just take himself out, too. That's fine. That's fine. If that's how they want to play it, then so be it. Let's go. Let's go. You battle this with honor. You're darn right I do. I'm an honorable dueler. I'm a duelman. But I do feel like I'm not making good progress here. I feel like I'm getting lost in this maze. Or is this... Am I, am I making good progress now? Is this towards the end? It's wrapping around. Here we go. Uh, an item. So I'm guessing that this is gonna go like left and then up and then like right and then down right. That's what that's the vibe I'm getting here. Up. Okay. And then there's the right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then there's the down. And then there's the right. Oh, did I tell? Did I predict that or what? Do I know a thing or two or three about things? Maybe. This feels like the end now. I feel like I'm close. Oh shit, there's another branch. Oh, okay, cool. At least that was a quick dead end. <laughs> oh, another knight! Was I supposed to hunt down all the knights? Oh man. Maybe, um, maybe this is good. All right, Excalibold. I'm not afraid of you. I know what you're all about. I'll spark you. That ought to be good, right? That ought to be the move. Okay, that was pretty good. Honestly, even though it wasn't very effective, it did seem like acrobatics was stronger. <laughs> Why is acrobatics so good, man? Oh, iron defense, fine by me, man. Fine by me, you know what? You wanna use that again next turn, too? You know what? You're done. You're out of here. That's it for you, that's all she wrote, my guy. Oh my goodness. And I get the level up, let's go. Dude, my team is crushing it. You battled this with honor. Yes, I did. 
So I defeated all these knights. Well, shit. I could have sworn that I was near the end. But I guess I was not. Uh-oh. Well, that's not good. That means I gotta go all the way back. And think about what I've done. It'd be interesting if this, like, maze changed as you beat the knights. But that would absolutely be like a mind uh, destroyer. <laughs> oh, boy. Um, so that was the dead end with the item. Oh, boy. I'm totally getting lost in here. I can do this, though. I don't want to end this episode until I beat this god dang labyrinth. I won't let this labyrinth be, uh, be the end of me. I won't be defeated. Did I? I think I already went down there, but I didn't go up here. Okay, what do we got? What's going on this way? Okay, okay, okay. Wait, this is starting to feel familiar, right? Isn't this... This isn't where I just came from, is it? Is this different? Oh, it was different. Nice. Past the trial of grass. However, a battle with yours truly is scheduled before facing the princess. Let's proceed for the above, then. All right, Armand. I'm not afraid of you. He's pretty scary looking. All right, Butler Armand. He's got a reindeer. I'm not afraid. I'm probably going to one-shot this with acrobatics, in all honesty. Because uh, acrobatics is pretty freaking good. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Why is it so strong? A Chigami? I'll switch for that. Um, what do I even have that's good against Fairy, though? You know, I'm going to hit him with Genos. I'm going to try my new strategy. My new busted strategy. It is fairy type, and I am—I do have a dark type, don't I? Like I'm part fire, or I'm part psychic and part dark. Oh, flash cannon! Oh shit! Oh, that wasn't too bad. Oh, come on, come on, Genos, come on! It's weird that that thing knows Razor Leaf. I guess because it's all about cutting. All right, so you're asleep now, and now I get to Dream Eater you. This is so good. Oh man. Oh, and it heals. Okay, that's busted. I'm gonna just go for a side beam now, just in case it wakes up. It didn't, but just in case. You know, you never know. I like to do things just in case, you know? Come on. Oh man, Genos is really good now. Huh, really impressive. Thank you, mister. Hmm, really impressive. The battle with the princess awaits you now. Come this way. Ooh, I'm gonna heal up my team then, and I'm gonna battle this princess. I bought a bunch of healing items, so now is a good time for me to use them. I will pop a super potion onto you. Actually, I think that's it for healing. I'm doing pretty dang good otherwise. All right, let's save, and then let's uh, let's go kick some butt, dude. Let's go. I'm not afraid of the princess. I defeated Armand, and I'm ready to destroy her Smeargle. Oh, this is cool. Look at that. Look at that like Hone Edge crest up there. Oh, this is nice. All right, let's fight. So you passed all the trials, but don't think you can beat me. I'm the princess. Before we get started, hand, hand me over that golden cup and the golden spoon. Yum, I can finally gobble up my ice cream now. Oh, I knew it was ice cream related. Oh, delicious. You fight better with a belly full of sweets, you know. My sugar, or my sweet and cute Pokemon will give you a real sugar rush. Prepare to lose to the Princess Vanilla of the Milky Way City Kingdom. Ooh, battle time. Listen to that music. All right, oh, she's mad, oh God. Let's go, Vanilla. Jam, jam, ooh. I'm gonna destroy you, mimic you. What you gonna do? When I spark? Oh, okay, toxic, crap. Well, that's bad. I'm planning on using spark right now, though, to break mimic you's uh, disguise, yeah. Oh, man. Oh, and the Paralyze. Nice. All right, Mimikyu's absolutely going down next turn. So Toxic didn't do too much damage first, but it's going to start doing way more later. Woodhammer. Interesting choice of move. I would not have gone with that. All right, um, I'll spark him again. Oh, shoot. I shouldn't have done that. Okay, maybe I should heal now. Getting Toxic off is actually going to be a big deal. Oh... Okay, I betcha they don't have enough to de to defeat me, or to at least KO Thundaga this turn. I betcha... Okay, cool, they're healing too. Nice! I could force her to use all of her healing items, while also using some myself. Oh wait, 
Oh no, this is good. Super Potion is good enough. Nice. Dazzling Gleam. I ain't even afraid. That was pretty good damage, though. Oh, and I got Shadow Snake, too. That's a pretty good move. But Acrobatics is also a pretty good move. What are you going to do? Also, I'm going to Roost. Ha ha ha! What are you going to do about that? Oh, that's right. You're going to do nothing. Nice. Okay, Acrobatics. Bada boom. Oh, that's a lot of experience, too. Let's go. Let's go. All right, Slurpuff. I'm not gonna switch for this. I'm not afraid of Slurpuff. Slurpuff is quite basic. Although Dazzling Gleam should hurt. Oh man, that hurt a lot. Oh crap. Why is Slurpuff faster than me and why is it destroying me? Oh man. I should have uh, healed there. That was a mistake on my part. I was afraid it was just gonna Dazzling Gleam again. Okay, well, shit. Maybe I should be afraid of Smeargle. Oh boy. Do I get Devour in there? I'm gonna try to get Devour in there. All right. What are you gonna do when I Phantom Force you? Aha! Suck on that. You're gonna go for a Thunderbolt. I can't believe that it knows Thunderbolt. That's actually scary as hell. Uh-oh, that's not good. Uh-oh. Yikes! Why is Slurpuff so strong? Okay, maybe I should have always been scared of Slurpuff. Wow! I'm out here getting one-shotted, man. All right, um, all right, Window Boy. It's your turn to take him out. Don't be afraid of this. Just Fire Fang him. Oh man, Dazzling Gleam. Oh, not very effective, nice. That's right, Sound is good against Fairy. That's gonna be my saving grace in this. Um, I'm actually gonna start trying to set up. I'm not very afraid of getting hit by Dazzling Gleam. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna Howl. Yeah, baby. Although, shoot, I don't have a sound physical move. If I had a sound physical move, then this would be my jam. All right, here we go. I'm a super potion, and then I'm gonna get in there with, um, I guess maybe Fire Fang. Uh, let's try to take him out here. Jeez, just dazzling gleam up the butt. All right, here we go. Nice. Now, I, I gotta hope that Smeargle doesn't do over 50 damage next turn. Or I guess 54 now. Please do 53 or less. Don't KO me. <laughs> Alright, Smeargle. I'm not switching. I'm going in. Oh, man. Look how cool it is. Alright, I'm going in. Draining Kiss? That shouldn't do too much damage at all. Okay, yeah, that did like nothing, right? I'm gonna destroy you now, baby. Oh, you're done. You're so done. Once again, I'm getting carried by my starter at the final bit of a gym battle. This is with the same case for Ginger. Let's go. No, I missed! You can't miss there, dude! I need you to hit those. Okay, thankfully Smeargle's like not doing any damage. Slurpuff was the real killer. Slurpuff was the hard one. Oh boy. GG's. Wow. But, but I'm the princess! Well, maybe try uh, being less terrible. Oh, I just lost, but no boohooing this time. I'm a princess and a gym leader as well. I cannot allow myself to act like a spoiled child if I want to fulfill these two roles. I realize this all thanks to the <laughs> thanks to the determination and the passion in your fighting style, Camu. I still have a lot to learn as a gym leader, but I'm sure Armand will help me. Thanks for opening my eyes, Camu. I will start fulfilling my duties with this. What's this? Could this be Dazzling Gleam? I like that move very much. Yes, it's Dazzling Gleam, a move that inflicts damage upon targets by emitting a powerful flash. Teach it to your Pokemon and you won't regret it. So in conclusion, it is my duty as a gym leader to award you the Sugar Badge. That's what that was. It's sugar. When I first saw it, I thought it was like clouds. Aw, nice. This will allow you to encounter, or to continue your trainer adventure in the Eldu region. Be sure to come and let me taste all the sweet delicacies you'll find along the way. Okay. Aw, that was so nice. I'm gonna save. Wow, I should definitely teach Dazzling Gleam to um, Chi-Chi also while I'm here. While it's fresh on my mind. There it is. Oh, man. Yes, please. Yes, please. Dazzling Gleam, yes, please. This is going to make Chi-Chi so much stronger. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, because Fairy Wind is 40 and this is 80. So I'm just like doubling my strength right now. Let's go, Chi-Chi. 
Let's go, man. Oh my gosh. All right, hopefully I can talk to Armand to get the heck out of here. Oh, there's like a little, is that a teleport switch? You defeat, or you could defeat the princess. You can go far as a Pokemon trainer. Here, use this platform to immediately return to the entrance of the gym. Whoa, do a little spin move. Oh, nice. That was so cool, man. Okay, well, I guess I can continue my adventure now to the um, east. However, I need to go heal. And then I also need to wrap up this episode because once again, this is another long one. This game is really freaking fun, man. I feel compelled to do long episodes because I want to like see these gyms through to the to the end. This is really good stuff, man. Anyway, that's gonna do it for this episode. I'm gonna skate on up here, and I guess I'll save like here. I think that's a good spot, right? Yeah. And then I will say thank you so much once again for watching. I appreciate you. Um, I hope you had a chill time hanging out with me once again today while I was playing through some more Pokemon Xenoverse. And until next time. I hope that you all have a good one.